War of Wrath was a legendary conflict in Lord of the Rings lore, a massive battle that concluded the first age of Middle-earth. This cataclysmic event was triggered by the ever-growing power of Morgoth, a fallen Valar who terrorized the lands from his fortress of Angban. Dominating Valyrian and driving its inhabitants into despair, Morgoth's rule seemed unstoppable until Arendil, a half-elven hero, risked everything to sail to the lands of the Valar. There he pleaded for aid, prompting the Valar to assemble an unprecedented alliance to confront Morgoth and liberate Middle-earth. The Valar led an army of Vanyar and Yoldor elves, along with the Three Houses of Men. In response, Morgoth mustered his forces, filling the plains and Falglith with orcs, balrogs, and all manner of dark creatures. For over 40 years, Middle-earth was engulfed in conflict, as the Valar's forces clashed with Morgoth's monstrous legions in brutal combat. Morgoth's army was vast, but slowly the forces of Amon prevailed, driving back his forces toward Angban. As defeat loomed, Morgoth unleashed his deadliest weapon, winged dragons, striking terror into the hearts of the Valar's troops. However, Arendil once again turned the tide, returning to the battlefield aboard his skyship Vingalo, joined by the Eagles of Manwe. Together they fought the dragons in a fierce aerial battle, eventually securing victory over Morgoth's last offensive. Angban was destroyed, and Morgoth was captured in his own mines. Tried by the Valar, Morgoth was cast into the timeless void beyond the door of night, forever banished from Middle-earth. In the wake of the War of Wrath, Middle-earth's western lands were devastated, sinking into the sea. The elves who had fought returned to the west, while men loyal to the Valar were gifted Numenor, a reward for their bravery in ending Morgoth's reign.